Hi folks, on today's show, a powerful Pinot Noir from Chile's Casablanca Valley, coming right up. Hi guys, welcome again to another edition of Big on Wine, the show that brings you, of course, news, clues and reviews about, yes, everything in the world of wine. And my Wine of the Week for this week comes indeed from the west coast of South America, and it's this one here. It's Novas Gran Reserva, and the vintage is 2016. And this wine comes in for a price of about 14 euro a bottle where I am. Okay, now this Novas Gran Reserva 2016 is a single variety Pinot Noir made by Vinieros Emiliana in the Valle de Casablanca in Chile. Now this is indeed a big wine, a powerful wine. It doesn't look like it, but it does pack a punch. Alcohol is 14.5% in this Pinot Noir. Now the Casablanca Valley, the Valle de Casablanca, or where the hell is that? I can hear you're asking out there. Well, this is on the coastal plain. Um, west of the capital Santiago, about 30 kilometers inland from the coast. And this is a very, very quickly fast growing wine region, um, which was started, founded roughly in the 1980s. Okay, so this is about an hour or so west of Santiago. Now this area, the Casablanca Valley, obviously features a lot of new technology. It has some premium wines, particularly the white wines, but also the cooler climate reds do extremely well here. So particularly Pinot Noir and Merlot. Okay, now the color in the glass is quintessential Pinot Noir. I think it has that kind of garnet red color, that kind of transparency, which we associate with Pinot Noir. Let's have a look at this in the nose and see what we get. And yes, we have that toasty red berry aroma, which immediately comes to the fore here. Um, fresh red berries in there, um, cherry, um, maybe even maybe even a touch of lingonberry and a toasty aroma arising from the wine there. Perhaps even maybe even a little touch of smoke in the background. Okay, let's have a look at this. This is a fairly light to medium bodied wine. Let's try it in the mouth. Mm. Very pleasant indeed. Now it's fairly light in terms of body but it does have a very long finish to it. Mm. So what am I getting in here? Well, I think I am getting sour cherry, I would say, is the predominant flavor. Sour cherry, um, touch of the lingonberry in there as well. Um, maybe even a touch of red currant in the mix there. The finish is interesting on this wine. Let me try another swig. Mm -hmm. well, not only is this wine big on alcohol, it's also pretty big on tannins as well and on acid. So we're getting a nice acid attack. This is going to be extremely good with food, predominantly meat dishes getting that nice mouth puckering tannin uh, flavor in the mouth there. Um, sour cherry finish, even a touch of leather, I think, in the finish of this wine. Now, what is a Pinot Noir like this going to be good with? Well, I would say this wine would make a great all-rounder with pretty much any meat dish. 
but probably is at its best with a stew or a casserole. How about a Basque style, slow cooked lamb and red pepper casserole? That would be absolutely wonderful with this Novas. Okay, now this is a wine I think you can serve slightly chilled. So this one here is around the 14, 15 degree mark. It works very well at that temperature. So slightly chilled. I'm going to give this Novas Gran Reserva Pinot Noir 2016, which comes in for around the 14 euro mark where I am. I'm going to give this three stars plus out of five. Okay guys, many, many thanks for taking the time to watch today's video. If you've enjoyed what you've seen and heard, then please feel free to give us that big thumbs up, hit the uh, big red button in order to subscribe. Drop a comment down below if you uh, feel like it. Naturally, share the video around. Follow me on all my other social media platforms. I'll be back again next week with another great Wine of the Week. But until we meet again, this is Tony Melville signing off and saying, hey, be good to each other. Take care out there. Enjoy your wines and cheers.